Have you ever noticed that your old smartphone batteries puff up like a blowfish? Over time, they could almost become twice the size of what they were. This puffing up could lead to the cathode and anode touching each other and it can lead to a situation like this. There are many reasons why your battery puffs up. A few reasons include placing the battery idle for a long time in high temperatures. This would lead to parasitic reactions between the electrolyte and the metal in the battery, which causes gases to release. As these gases have no way of escaping, they tend to push against the walls of the battery, causing it to puff up. Sometimes during the manufacturing process, the metal used to make the battery could have impurities in them. This could lead to unwanted reactions between the electrolyte and the metals present inside and this in turn could lead to the release of a lot of gases. So again, this leads to pressure buildup which makes the battery puff up. If overcharging is done with the wrong charger type, this could also lead to swelling and long-term damage to the phone's battery. Hey, what do I do to prevent this? Well, don't worry. We got you covered. First up, you should stop hammering your phone like this. Second, prevent storing your phone or battery at high temperatures for long duration of time. And third is that pray that you get a battery with no manufacturing defects. If you're planning on not using your phone for a long duration, ensure that you shelf it after charging it fully. This swelling or puff up does not occur in cylindrical lithium ion batteries. That is why you never see your power banks swell as they use cylindrical cells. These cells have gas release vents inside them, so any excess gas formation is released through the vents. Newer types of battery manufacturing techniques have been employed in recent years to solve this problem. LG's stack and folding method have promised to eliminate the swelling in the battery pouches and effectively increase the battery life. All right, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions or comments, please drop them in the comment section down below. Do check out our website. We have a compilation of industry targeted courses from simulation of IC engines to aerodynamics to all the way up to battery management systems and more. Right? Thank you so much. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.